A former senator and three others caught, in, caught up in an alleged scheme of white-collar crimes arraigned in the magistrate's court today. Our Antone Smith was in court. An alleged million-dollar money laundering ring ends today as police haul four suspects, one a former senator, before the courts in connection with a number of fraudulent charges. Prominent public figure Elma Campbell, along with her son Che Chase, were charged before Chief Magistrate Joanne Ferguson Pratt with 18 counts of money laundering and fraud by false pretense. The charges are in relation to a September incident where it is alleged the duo unlawfully obtained one point. $2 million from a Royal Bank of Canada account, property of the Ministry of Tourism. 37-year-old attorney Che Chase, also indicted on possession of a forged document, allegedly acquiring this money via a forged check made payable to the Campbell Chase law firm. From there, police say the money was deposited onto a joint account owned by the mother-son duo who made withdrawals. Several large purchases, including a gray 2020 BMW vehicle and a number of transfers before being caught. On the receiving end of those transfers, it's alleged are two well-known marketing professionals, Leah Davis and Damalis Curry. Charged with two counts of money laundering, Davis allegedly received two sums of money totaling almost $50,000, allegedly receiving more than $400,000 through his company, Bahamas Outdoor Media, Curry appeared before the courts on one single money laundering charge. All four defendants pled not guilty to the charges levied against them, and without proper jurisdiction to grant bail, Chase and Campbell were transported to the Supreme Court for an emergency bail hearing. All four defendants are due back in court on March 30th for trial. Antoine Smith, ZNS Network News.